Hey, everybody. Working on Algebra 2 here. Lesson 1.5, 1 1-5. And let's uh, take a look at this problem that we uh, refer to the graph shown to the right, match the description. Oh, before I get to that, pardon me. Um, this is problem nine on the year I'm explaining it, but in case I use it another year and we change it around, less than 1.5 or 1 5. And, my other number I might need is 34. All right. So uh, the graph's given at the right, and we're supposed to just find the solution. So we did one of these earlier. I don't know. It was maybe the first or second problem in the lesson. And all we did is we went over here, found where the lines intersect, and then took note that in the actual problem, the only variables we see are x's. So even though this coordinate right here, it looks like three negative two to me, this point right here, looks like three negative two. And you can uh, zoom in if you use that graph, maybe that helps to get zoomed in so you can see three and the negative two better. Um, you can also, if you don't like using that to zoom in, you can click on the button below to pop it out into a whole separate window, three, negative two, and that might be a little more clear now. Um, remember what we said many times, there's no y in this problem. So the negative two is really just to help us figure out the coordinate graph. The x, that's the three, is my only answer. So I'm going to go over here, click on that three, check and see what we did. That's all there is to that. So hopefully that one doesn't seem too complicated to you. Don't mean for it to. And that's, we'll move on to the next problem. So good luck.